Okay, so now we have all the areas clean. Our next step is, is we're gonna attach the electrode stickers to areas that we use. There's the mastoid bone back here. This is considered mastoid two. So you're going to put one sticker there. Mastoid one. The left side of the head is all odd numbers. The right side of the head is all even. Circle the patient around. This is for the patient's right eye. Patient's left eye. We use these markings up here as our reference and ground. And then last but not least, our chin leads. If you have a patient that is male and has stubble, I would suggest that you have them shave. Clean shaven will allow these to stick with this little bit of scruff here. It's almost a guarantee that these stickers will be before the end of your study come off. Okay. And we attach our EKG. That's for our EKG2. Okay, have you lift your arm, sir? And that's for our EKG1. Now make sure you have proper placement for the legs. You ask the patient to keep their heel on the ground and you have them pull their toes up off the floor. And if you notice this muscle right here flexes out, so this is the proper positioning for the leg leads. And here's the leg leads that we previously threaded down the patient's clothing. And you just snap those on and those are all set to go. Again, sir, heel on the floor, pull up your toes. You're attaching, you see how there's actually slack here. Some of the patient bends their legs in the middle of the night, those leads will not snap off. So I'm just gonna go ahead and snap our leads to these. People sometimes develop a color code system. It's very helpful to, to develop something like that because when you have failure with one of the wires, it's easier to trace it back once you have it plugged into the head blocks. Okay. So then our next step is to use our 1020 paste. And what we're going to be attaching is what we call gold cups. And basically what you do is you end up scooping the 1020 paste to fill the cup like this. You're going to press down on the head, and as you press down on the head, the 1020 paste will make an adhesion and also put some through the center of the cup. That's how you know you have a good connection. And you're gonna cover it with a little more 1020 paste and gauze. Okay. 